In this video, we're going to look at key points on a parabola. So we would get our computer package and we would plot y equals x squared minus 2x minus 8 and it would give us this black parabola below. Now we want to see what some of the key points are. So the first one we can look at, the roots or the x-intercepts. That's where the curve crosses the x-axis. So here's the x-axis is the flat horizontal one and it crosses these two points. And if we put their coordinates by it, that is negative 2, 0 and 4, 0 are the coordinates of the roots. Next, the y-intercepts. Now, this is where the curve crosses the y-axis. So the y-axis is this one here, the vertical one, and it crosses at that point there, which is negative 8. And its coordinates are 0, negative 8. The last key point to look at is the turning point. And this is either the highest point, which we call a maximum point, or the lowest point of the parabola, which we call a minimum point. So in the case of the one we've got here, we've got a minimum point there. And if we work out its coordinates, it is negative 1, negative 9. So they're all the key points for this curve. OK, let's go on to the next one. So this time we're going to put into our computer package y equals 6 minus x minus x squared. Now note, the curve under this one looks the other way around, and that's all to do with the fact that there is a negative in front of the x squared. So let's find its key points. So its roots are where it crosses the um, x-axis. So it crosses the x-axis here and here, and they would have coordinates of 2, 0 and negative 3, 0. Next, let's look where it crosses the y-axis. So the y-axis is here, and it crosses the y-axis at 0, 6. And the last point is its turning point. Now, its turning point here is its highest point, so that makes it a maximum point. And its coordinates are negative 0 0.5, 6.25. 